Devin Townsend here, last episode of the Empath documentary. This is a record that took me 18 months to make. Uh, and a lot of that was just the thinking about it. Like, what is it that I'm trying to say? And, and uh, this documentary series documented that whole process in a way. And episode seven here is the conclusion of it. And I think this is, during this conversation, I, I, I seem to remember um, being able to sort of put the pieces together and understand what my motivations were. And I think while I was making the record, there were certain parts where I was really afraid of. It's like, oh man, I'm making heavy music again, and I'm making this quiet music again. And throughout my career, I've been told that you can't mix these things together. And the emotional ups and downs of it uh, were so extreme on this process that I spent a great deal of time uh, making sure that uh, my intentions and my reasons for making this record were, were healthy. Uh, I firmly believe that as artists, we are just fortunate to be able to um, hear music that kind of already exists. And my job during this process is really just to try and articulate that as, as accurately as I can because I'm uh, humbled to be able to be a musician and to represent this uh, music as anybody who is an artist should be. So by the time I got to the end of it, I realized there's a very strong, um, you got to hang in there sentiment. To the record, uh, with the amount of people that are depressed and and you know the amount of negativity that we uh, feel from the news, I feel as somebody who has an empathic or empathetic nature, what I see, what I ingest with uh, the media and and things that you know what I eat or or who I spend time with, whatever comes in is going to come out. So when I listen to this record and how abstract it is and how heavy it is and how strange it is at parts. I think people could be uh, uh, forgiven for feeling that my um, mental state is erratic when it actually is not. I just feel that truly it's a representation of what it's all been for the past couple of years. And it's been crazy. We, we know how crazy it's been in the world. And so this is what the record ended up being about. And I realized while doing this interview that because life is brutal, of course it's going to have brutal music. Because life is also beautiful, of course it's going to have beautiful music. But ultimately, um, we're all kind of in it together, and no one is any better or any worse than anybody else. And um, we just have to do our best to uh, be, uh, uh, you know, uh, proud or or uh, humbled by the universe and how amazing it is and how little we know and really we've only got each other right so uh, if you're having any problems and you're dealing with depression all this as I do as many people do uh, hopefully this creative process that went into this record uh, will help each other right so hang in there men and women and everyone else uh, this is the last one thank you so much for allowing me to do this thanks to Inside Out thanks to Northern Music, thanks to everybody who uh, supports what I do and allows me to continue doing it. To be creatively this abstract after 25 years of doing it is uh, such a gift, and I certainly don't take it lightly. Take care of yourselves. Thanks for paying attention. I hope you enjoy the record. See you next one. i got a bunch of new music now, so I'm so psyched to be done this. <laughs> Cheers.